All right, so I met this woman, I don't know, maybe two weeks ago or so. I was trying to give her some time to, like, you know, pass on. What are the odds somebody's going to come across my YouTube channel and see this, right? So, she's all excited we got this money, right? So, I'm like, you know, it's actually hurting you more than it's helping you. You realize it, right? And she just threw a fit, you know. Oh, well, the pandemic, of course, she's got to wear the diaper on her face and everything has affected me more than anybody else. She, she's um, an Uber driver, okay? So she would spend, currently she's paying about $70 a week in um, gas. So I, I, I just threw that out there. We, we got the $1,400, right? Well, guess what? <laughs> she, and her argument is, well, we're gonna have inflation anyway. You're, you're killing it with inflation, okay? Look at gold just skyrocketing, which is gonna happen all the time. It's because gold is God and there's nothing above it, right? No, it, it, gold is, is, is subject to really inflation. That's <laughs> it's not like it's like a supply and demand. You just got miners digging for gold. Trust me, I'm an investor in gold. I know gold, and, and gold has been crushing the S and P and the Dow for the last forever. And, and you got to be fair too with this. I got one back making another video about this with regard to the Dow Jones. You keep pulling the bad companies out and putting new companies in. So we're like above 31,000 now. All right, so you've taken how many companies out? See, no, I mean, it's just, AI, geez, another one. I love that one. Okay, so 70 times 50. Okay, so basically, and we, we did the math. It's like, if, what the funny thing is, is that, okay, so we, we saw gas prices a year ago, what they were before the pandemic a little bit more more than a year ago it was just above a buck 50 a gallon i know where i'm going with this just in gas prices alone you can see inflation so gas prices i just went down, drove down the street drove i drove i, I scooted okay i'll stop lying <laughs> we're looking at buck with 279 i think that's good. That's down from when this woman and I were talking. It was like 287, 289 a gallon. I'm, I'm, I'm being really conservative here. I mean, you can see South Beach will be over four dollars a gallon. So, <laughs> just in gas alone, and even during the pandemic, I was in Ohio and gas. I saw gas on the corner of Puritus and you know, 150th and Puritus right there, just uh, to the south of 480, about a quarter of a mile. I saw it as low as, somebody has said they saw it at 89, but I, I saw it at 97 cents. And of course that was when, what, end of July last year. But that's historically crazy weird low. That's, we're not going to use that, it's too much of an outlier. Let's just use a buck 50 or buck 60. So basically you, you cut your, 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 your gas right there, your expenses, okay, <laughs> it's already doubled in, in one year for her, okay, because you see gas prices are doing what it's doing. Nah, because of Biden. Biden's bad dude. Trump's bad dude. They're both scum, filthy. They got a lot of good in them too, all right? But it's not a Biden or Trump thing. It's 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 a what it is thing. It's what it is, okay? So that's just one example right there. They put more than $3,000 and, you know, that's, just do the math on that. That's $1,500. You know, and more, and just in gas alone, you're looking at She'd have been getting more, and that's just one year. We're talking 2022, 2023, 2024, every year. And then there's so many other things too, you know, food and I don't know how much change with regard to electricity and water and all that stuff. Rent is going to be going up. Oh, she's throwing a fit about that too because rent went up like almost 10%. She didn't say 10%. She said $100, which is almost 100. It's almost 10%. That's, well, duh, I'm telling you, it's another $1,200 a year almost. So, there, I mean, it just, just, you know, and all, and all this stuff up, I mean, you've well, well over the $1,400. And where does my, 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 most of this money go? It's it, 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 me, I mean, it's going to multiply it. The reality is, most people are drug users. I see this really pretty girl, way, way out there. That's, and I, I got really good eyes, right? <laughs> 
I'll show you where I am. I just found, I was here like in 2000, or 1997. And yeah, I've been, I forgot about this spot, man. Where's that? I'll be over here not now. All right. So, yeah, I've been staying at, you know, various hotels and stuff. And obviously, Cedar Place, the video I made of my homeless apartment and off of Art of US 1. But anyway, just look, at, just look at the inflation on this stuff. Not just inflation, but you, you have to increase prices when you got more money coming in. It's going to be, you know, rent going up higher and all that other stuff. And gas, oh my god. Transportation for everything. Wow. We can't keep living on excuses, y'all.